318 is hugely important because for any design you have to use 318. It also relates to construction, uh, quality control. So, uh, you know, you can't get around it. It's the Bible. Oh, it's pretty much our Bible. Uh, all our designs come from 318. Well, it is obviously very important. You know, you, you can't design reinforced concrete or even pre-stressed concrete without using 318. And we're constantly using it. There's not a week that goes by that we don't use 318. So it's, it's vital to us. I believe it's a good approach, what they've done to kind of consolidate some of the chapters and make it more easily and use it friendly. In the end, it's going to be a much better system and no more hodgepodge collection of various topics. It's going to be a much more linear process for them to use rather than trying to find a whole bunch of places in the code in each and every applicable clause. To me, it's it's the readability and the, and the, and the organization. It's so much easier to go through now. And therefore, we're getting, we know what we're going to get at the other end, a building that's going to be safe, secure, and uh, be there for a long time. I've been using 318 for about 25 years now, and this is, to me, a major step forward. I think the reorganization is going to be fantastic. I think it'll be a good, and, and it'll be easy to transition to as well. I think it's great. I think it's something that needed to be done. I'm excited. I am excited about it. Our industry is always about you know, learning how to do things a lot easier, a lot better. It's going to be really good for everybody. We're talking about human lives here, so anything that we can do to make our design that much more safer, the quality higher, is always going to do great for our industry.